Um, there will be a very stark contrast between me and Jerry Brown, and the people of California will have a very clear choice. And it will be between someone who has been in politics for 40 years, um, with not a great record in many ways, Carla. You know, you go back to his governorship, he started with a surplus, he ended with a billion dollar deficit. Unemployment doubled to nearly 11 percent, which was at that time a record high under his governor's run. Oakland was not good results. I mean, the Oakland public school system, which he tried to reform, was in such bad shape that the state had to come in and take over the public school system. And the reaction to every problem in Oakland was raise taxes. And he tried to raise taxes on everything from garbage collection to cable TV to you name it. The voters, approved those, the voters approved those taxes. They didn't actually re approve many of them. He tried to raise taxes by about $400 million. Not too much of it got through, but the reaction was not how do we do things more efficiently. The reaction was let's raise taxes to solve the problem. But I guess the question is if you want to contrast to Jerry Brown Young? 30 years ago, then isn't it fair to contrast? Mm -hmm your past to voters, too. Just a couple years ago, you weren't a voter. You supported Barbara Bosch. Sure. What about that? Absolutely. The whole record is um, fair game here. And I think my belief is the election will turn on jobs. And I've been in business for 40 years. I have created jobs. I have met a budget. I have been the res on the receiving end of stifling regulation. eBay sellers that I know personally have been on the stifling end of, of regulation. So, so <coughs> people are going to decide, do I want a 40-year career politician or do I actually want someone who has walked in the shoes of doing business in California? And um, boy, I know more about the economy than anyone in this race. I know more about creating jobs than anyone in this race. And that's a really, um, you know, I think that's a real advantage. And, um, and then it will be about the vision that we paint and how we want to get there. And um, you know, Jerry's whole campaign is going to be funded by the unions. Yeah. And if you believe that the unions and the union pension issue for the civil servants is a problem here, it's going to be hard for him to take that on. And my view is, we talked about pensions, my view is if we don't change the pension situation here, this is a 60 to $100 billion unfunded pension liability coming down the tracks at us. And this will actually cause the state to fundamentally run out of money, and then we're all in a, in a real world of hurt. And 17 other states, by the way, have done that.